What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another class at the Burndown Academy. I'm Justin. I'm Eric. Today's class, we're going to teach you how to refill your torch lighter. So grab your lighters because class is in session. What's going on, everybody? Class is in session. So today's class, what are you gonna do when you got no more butane left in your torch? So there's two things that you have to do to refill your torch lighter. Step one is you have to bleed the lighter, which basically means get rid of all the excess butane and get rid of all the air bubbles that are trapped inside the lighter. Step two, you gotta know how to refill your lighter. So let's start with step one. It's a good place to start. For <laughs> fortunately, Eric's lighter is out of butane. Got no more, nothing, nothing left. It's done. So we need to bleed the lighter. We need to get rid of all his air bubbles, any excess butane that's kind of trapped in there that's not really lighting. So how do you do that? So you will see a little pinpoint at the bottom of your butane lighter. Now how you get the excess out, you take a toothpick, take a pen, take anything sharp that will fit into this little pilot hole right here. So you want to take the pen, or any sort of point, you can use a toothpick, you can use a paper clip. You just want something small that you can fit into inside that little hole right there. <laughs> now typically, when you're doing this, you'll hear, or not typically, actually every single time, you'll hear some hissing, something like this. Let's see if you can hear it. So what he's doing is he's letting all the air out and all those air bubbles that are trapped inside the lighter. So you just take the pen, you take the paper clip, you take the toothpick, whatever you got, you jam it inside that little hole, and you want to press down on the little button right there. It's a tiny little button. You just press down, it's going to let all the air out, and you're basically clearing out the entire lighter to be ready to be refilled. And you just keep going until you hear nothing after. Nothing. So now let's move on to step two, refilling the lighter. So you have your butane, you have your lighter. Now the first thing you want to do is take your butane torch, turn it upside down. You want to get your butane, give it a little shake, shake, shake -a And simple as that, just insert it. Now, what you want to do is make sure that you keep your butane upright like Eric is. Don't fill it with the butane up like that. It's not going to work. Don't do this. That's not going to work. You're just going to lose all the butane and you can like Eric's doing right now. So you keep your, your butane inverted, keep your lighter inverted. And what you should hear is a small hissing, but you don't want to see the butane squirting out. That means it's not going into the lighter, you're just releasing it into the air. Something like this. Yes, so when you hear that, the butane's going in. If you start seeing it squirt out, the butane's not going in. And you want to make sure there's no excess. You don't want, to, you don't want anything popping out of here because you're not getting anything into your butane torch. So you keep holding it like that, keep pressing down. When the lighter's full, you won't hear that hiss anymore. Give it a little shake, give it a little shake. So now, once you think it's full, you just gotta give it a little test. It's lit! Sometimes it will take one, two, three, four presses to get the uh, butane in the torch, but usually you'll be good. So that's how you refill a torch lighter. Thanks for joining this class at the Burndown Academy. Class is adjourned.